I haven't done an unboxing of a PlayStation 5 game in a good while. So I'm here with guilt for PS5. I'm Michael Ann. If you enjoy my content, please hit the subscribe button. Like button also. Share with your friends if you don't mind. Also, please comment. Ask me a question or a comment in general. I'll do my best to answer them. Also, if you don't mind, hit the notification bell down below. And you will be notified when I go live or upload another video. If you want to become a fan of me, Auckland, then subscribe to the channel and you will become a fan. I hope so. Guilt was originally a Google Stadia game exclusively. Which Google Stadia, if you don't already know, was a streaming service strictly for video games that failed and ended this year. And they brought this over to consoles. And amazingly, so happy that it happened. A physical copy happened for PS5 and for PS4. And of course, I got the PS5 copy. Really been looking forward to playing this game. It reminds me a lot like Little Nightmares. But it's a little bit different. You play as a girl named, I believe her name is Sally. This game has some bullying stuff in there. So if that bothers you, and you probably shouldn't play this game because it has this in here. But it does it in a interesting kind of way. This game also kind of reminds me of Silent Hill. If you ever played Silent Hill, it was like you're in a town. And then all of a sudden you go to another town that looks exactly like the one that you were in. Except this one is overran by monsters. Then you have guilt. It's basically what this is. Alright. Um, set in a creepy world, guilt is an eerie story. Mixing fantasy and reality. Uh, in a surrealist place. Where your nightmares become reality. Hide from terrible creatures. Or con confront them as you find your way through the challenges of this wicked world. And how you fight the enemies is by using a flashlight. So it's a very interesting mechanic. It's, now that's been done before. If you ever played the original Alan Wake. You can fight monsters with a flashlight. So it has been done before in games. But this is more like a cartoony kind of way. Now this is a horror game. But it's not like you know horror horror i've seen reviews of this game where kids have been playing this game so it's not creepy to the point where it will bother a child but then again i guess it all depends on their perspective of what might scare them it comes with some stickers which is really cool now there there is a collector's edition of this out as well it comes with a lot of extra goodies and stuff which is very, very cool. But I just got the standard release of the game. Let's check out the artwork. Uh, it's a little bit of artwork on the inside. Not very much at all. But it's still there. And here is the disc. For the PS5 version. I thought about showing off gameplay. But the TV is being occupied right now. Which is fine. I have my friend Kev playing over right now. So that's fine right now, uh, but I'm about to actually soon play this. I've been really, really looking forward to playing this game. As soon as I found out the physical copy was happening, it's like, shoot ya. Because I prefer my games physically over digital any day of the week. So yeah, I'm about to go and play this right now. And this came from Video Games Plus. I believe it's a... Canadian focused uh, gaming store because there's an actual retail store over there but you can go to the website and order this game so very very cool awesome really looking forward to this please let me know down in the comments did you play this game back in the day on Google Stadia or are you playing this on consoles I think it's available also on the Xbox as well sadly no switch and also it's available on PC. So I would love to know how are you feeling about this game. How are you liking it. I would just love to know. If you've never even heard of this game. I would love to know that as well. That would be amazing to actually know. But this game. From what I've seen of the gameplay and the reviews. It's incredible. And I'm looking forward to it. Alright. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much. Alright. Bye.